on the the history of Westeros. The, Westeros, you know. There were only two peoples. Yeah. Uh, but Westeros the, to the shores. There were two peoples. I said the children of the forest and the race of creatures known as the giants. Of the giants in the Dawn Age, little and less can be said, <laughs> for no one has gathered their tales, their legends, their histories. Men of the Watch say the wildlings have tales. The giants lived uneasily alongside the children, ranging where they would and taking what they wanted. All the accounts claim that they were huge and powerful creatures, but simple. Reliable accounts from the rangers of the Night's Watch, who were the last men to see the giants while they still lived, state that they were covered in thick fur, or rather than simply being very large men, as the nursery tales hold. This is considerable evidence of burials among the giants, as recorded in Meister Kennet's Passage of the Dead, a study of the burial fields in the grave tombs of the north in the time of service at Winterfell, during the long reign of Cregan Stark. This is your fault, Jay. From bones... <laughs> <laughs> 